Hey ladies, how you doing today? My name is Erin, this is my girlfriend Rebecca, and we are known as In Between Friends. You check us out here on YouTube. You can also check us out at our vlog, www In Between Friends. We talk about pregnancy related issues, baby related issues, currently talking about infancy because I have infants. Yay! <laughs> <laughs> I have two little men that were born three weeks ago today. Are the lights of my life. So cute. Mm -hmm. I was uh, telling, come on, of course I'm going to say they are. They're ridiculous. They're delicious. I will going to suck their faces off. Verify. Yeah, they do. Done. Attest to that, please. Um, I was telling Rebecca that we made our first outing yesterday beyond going to the pediatrician. I was like, yeah. The non-medical outing. Non-medical outing. <laughs> um, we were very excited about it. We went to Costco. And Which is where every family dreams of going for right? the first it, it, it is. <laughs> I literally, that was panicked about like Costco fingers. You know, like just people like touching stuff and then wanting to touch babies and it was just, it, it, it was that essentially. Um, my husband has this fabulous Wego and you can hold two twins, okay. uh, twins in a little front carrying okay. case. So you saw where these two little heads bobbing. Um, I will tell you that as we got close to Costco, I looked at my husband and I said, I feel like we should have done a dry run first. <laughs> you know, like strapped them all in, seeing what it was like, walk around the backyard. It's like, yeah. I was going to tell you that before we left. I didn't <laughs> want to scare you. And once I got there, I realized yeah, we didn't need a dry run. We yeah, really didn't need it's going to have I mean, Yeah, it's not as yeah. terrifying as it seemed, it's, as it seemed in the car. Um, but it did get me thinking, and to be fair, it was a production. It was a production yeah. getting in the car, it was a production getting out of the car, getting things situated. It was a production walking through Costco, looking at a product, then looking back at the babies to make sure they're still breathing, and then looking at something else, and then looking back at the babies to make sure, and then pushing Granny away, who wants to come in with her dirty Costco fingers, you know? Like, it was, a, germs it was a production, and I don't think I'll be doing too many of them. Yeah. Um, not necessarily Costco, but just outings. Yeah, and that's and that's where you weigh the how much energy did it actually take for me to complete a trip to Costco with two babies, or could I stay home and then while they're napping, yeah. quick run to Costco by myself, conquer the world, and then come back in time for the next feeding? Yeah, yeah choice B, choice ladies, B. choice B. Yeah. But that first outing is huge, and it's just awkward. Let's mm -hmm. just call it what it is. Totally. You have to be completely realistic, mm -hmm. totally and completely. Give yourself enough time. Yeah. Don't be on a time crunch. Don't be like, I'm just going to run in. There's no just running in no. anymore. A, you're not running anywhere anywhere after you give birth. Well, and B, until they're like 13 years old, you're not running anywhere. Yeah. You're like dragging, kicking, and screaming, and yeah. bribing, and no. entertaining. Please. Yeah. The other thing is choose your time wisely. Thinking about who you're taking with you, mm -hmm. I'm taking newborns. Newborns are awake for maybe 40 minutes, mm -hmm. and then they go back to sleep. If you can get them in asleep and in their carrier, have a great time. Yeah. Go out, but know that you need to be back, or you need to be ready to feed them in about you know three hours from their last feeding. If you can wrap your brain around that, this is not about your schedule anymore, it's all about theirs, then go for it. Go have an adventure. If not... Stay home. Put the people who are screaming at Costco. Why? The kids that are screaming at Costco. Why? They're tired. Mm -hmm. They're exhausted. They've been pushed. I mean, I was in line at Barnes Noble at Christmas time. Three year old in the stro three years old in the stroller having a meltdown. The mother insisted on waiting in line that was twenty people deep. And I wanted to tell her, put your stuff at the counter, lay away for three hours. Take your kid home. Take your kid home and have them sleep. It would make my shopping experience pleasant. Mm -hmm. So again, realize, choose your time wisely. Mm -hmm. When are you going? When it will be easier for you? Yes. Yeah. It's all about making it easy. Why struggle? Yeah. Why make this worse for yourself? Yeah. Choose it wisely. Yeah, and I know some of you might be chomping at the bit to get out. Like I had sure. mentioned previously, it was sure. nice to get out and feel human again and part yeah. of part of a productive society that doesn't that have spit up on them and you know is getting <laughs> sleep and all that stuff. But that being said, does the end justify the means? And by the time you are done with said production, is it going to be worth really going out? No. A good movie in your living room on your big screen. Yeah, seriously. That's what I'm all about. Yeah, seriously, though. <laughs> so, realistic. Realistic. Hopefully this helps. 
like our video, subscribe to our YouTube channel, um, leave a comment below. How do you get out and about with your children, your kitties along for the ride? Is there any secrets that you would love to share with us that we just haven't thought about? Um, we'd love to hear from you. Uh, again, you can jump over to our blog, like Erin mentioned at the beginning, at www.inbetweenfriends.com. And uh, until then, ladies, hopefully you get out. Hopefully you get some little peace in your life. You get a little break. But also, we hope that you are content with what you are currently in the middle of. I know. I was going to say strapped with. No. That's not a good... No. What you're blessed with. Ladies. Yeah. Have a great day. Bye.